The county jail had been on a modified lockdown due to COVID-19. Inmates spending four hours in the cell, four hours out, rotating. But due to these new developments, the county's gone to full lockdown. Officials say a corrections officer and a civilian employee tested positive for the virus. The two are on administrative leave and quarantining at home. Contact tracing underway as a result. They've also learned a former inmate who was in the jail last week for about 15 hours tested positive for COVID. Officials alerted by the inmate's family. They say while awaiting bond, the inmate was isolated in a cell away from the general population. Even with that, as a precaution, officials did go to full lockdown. Staff and inmates had already been wearing required masks and additional sanitation procedures put in place weeks earlier continue. As a result of the positive test, though, they're being enhanced. Officials still feel confident the virus is not in the general population, but they are monitoring this situation very carefully. In Volusia County, Claire Metz, WESH 2 News. Now, there has been a significant outbreak at a state prison near Daytona Beach. At this point, 138 inmates at Tomoka Correctional Institution have tested positive for the virus along with 23 employees.